Whenever I'm in Alberta, I'm always listening to like the Alberta music. But I know it doesn't come through on the Discord side. Oh, I'm gonna start the stage in a second. <laughs> to title these stage events. <laughs> the real question is what do I title these things? Uh new three V three V three TV Pimbo. I think on YouTube said I'm having issues again. Right, well, I'll, I'll figure out the YouTube thing later. <laughs> it's gonna be bad again. What is up, everybody? Good evening. Good morning. How are you? <laughs> How's everyone doing? What are you all up to lately? What are you all up to lately? I haven't seen you all since the month started. How'd you all do on, on your rolling and everything this month so far? There we go again. Wee! <laughs> what is up, everybody? How goes it? Is there no sound? There should be sound. Do you not hear me? I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> Yeah, other people can hear me. Check, uh, check your, check, uh, check, check your sound on your side. Yeah, check your sound on your side, because I think other people can hear me. <laughs> yeah, others, others can hear me. Oh my gosh. Because I see, I see, I see the green popping up. So I'm talking to both Discord and on YouTube. So if you were, if you're looking for, um, also XP on the official Discord, um, now you can get XP for being a part of the um you know checking out streamers so if you also want to you know accumulate xp um and the discord side you can do that watching streamers um you know that's also an option what's up arcane over on youtube how are you how are you how goes it <laughs> Yeah, check your settings if, um, because also there's, there's a lot of ways on Discord that you can, like, sometimes accidentally, like, um, mute, m mute things and mute, uh, people and stuff like that, so. <laughs> there's a, there's a lot of, there's a lot of settings and things. There's, there's a lot of ways that tech can go wrong. Trust me, I know. I know. Oh, yeah, that's right, because, yeah, the last stream I was going to do, actually, I, I had a really hard time. I was... <laughs> Oh boy, my internet, my internet was down. There was, um, there was bad weather in my area. That's right. I had a stream scheduled and I had bad weather in my area. And then like the power was out and then the internet was out and then, and then everything came back. And I was like, oh, finally, huff. All right, I can still stream. And then I had some kind of tech issue with Discord. I'm like, you know what? <laughs> today, today is apparently not the day. <laughs> so <laughs> these things just happen. So anything can go wrong on the tech side. <laughs> what is up? Good morning. Good evening. How are you all? How are you all? <laughs> How goes it? How goes it? <laughs> So I thought we'd check out uh, some of the stuff on CVT today um, because there's like the new PvP mode. Maybe we could talk about that. Um, you know, if uh, I don't know if everyone heard, there's um, the new 3v3v3 map. Um, but there's also a new, uh, you know, UI overhaul to the PvP screen that I thought was really, really cool. 
<laughs> yeah, triple threes. Excuse me. So yeah, so hopefully uh, I'm gonna see about about matchmaking. We'll see. We'll see if anyone's, you know, since since I'm not in an optimal time frame as well. I did try to do a call out to you know. Also, if if you have a CBT account and you want to try matchmaking or or we could party up, you know, that's also an option too. So we'll see if we can get um some some runs going. Let's see if we can check out the map. <laughs> Trifecta, yeah. So I've seen um what's it called. I've seen, uh, you know, we've seen the screen. So this is like the new PVP screens. I'm not sure how many have seen this, but this is like the all new screen for PVP. So like we have sixes on the far left. This is 12. So on, uh, on CBT right now, they have like a season going on. And this is what it looks like. Like as you open it up, it's very fancy. It's very fancy. Um, <laughs> like the way it looks and everything and the like the options like it's it looks very nice it's very sleek it's very it's very nice looking it's very fancy <laughs> um and then this is like the 3v3 you have like the preview here currently there's only one option because they're only testing the casual mode right now since they're only you know they want to give feedback and all that for the time being so there's no um how do you say there's no tournament mode or seasonal mode right now for the time being but when it comes to like 12s like you know there's like a season and um you know like uh the the casual weeks the see the you know well season cup mode rather and and so on and so forth oh and then they also do have the new uh map or rather they have opened up the 12s map to be an open room that you can have for larger skirmishes for up to 100 versus 100 players that you could also put together yourselves. So that's also an option moving forward um, and all that sort of stuff. So it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. What is up, Aripe? What's up, Frederick? How are you? Uh, does it do random matchmaking if you don't have a party? So I did, uh, did kind of like click it before. And it does look like, what did it tell me? I don't know what this says now. Is it because I left the queue before? <laughs> I was trying I was trying to check the queue to see if it was working. <laughs> Am I in trouble? There are, oh, it says team members. Let me see if you continue the system. Oh, so it's telling me um, there are insufficient team members. If you continue to match, the system will randomly group you into other groups. Players participate um, in team compositions. Yeah, so it's basically telling me like the same thing of, you know, you don't have a party, you, you know, you're not in a full group, so we're going to throw you into, like, a random group. So, I'll click it for now. I'll see I'll see if a match makes me for now. I'm not sure what's going on. Yeah. You know. Um. <laughs> I think it's the, I, I would say it's probably, like, the morning over there. So, we'll see. We'll see if anything happens. So, <laughs> but if any players... <laughs> Um, also when we part of the test or, or team up and, or whatever else we can do that. <laughs> CBT, yeah. <laughs> but, um, but the thing is, but what's also interesting about the mode itself is that it's currently set up to be, uh, like full firepower, which they updated the full firepower mode itself as well. Um, so if I look at, I have to pull out, I gotta look at my other screen. If, if, if I set this up correctly ahead of time and I did not, um, <laughs> I have to go to the community server and go to the translations kindly provided by Beacon. <laughs> um, they optimized full firepower mode. Um, so below are what they changed and adapted for full firepower. Uh, it says, I, I should, I should have made like a thing and I didn't, I apologize. Um, uh, <laughs> below are the attributes that, that activate upon entering this mode. Handbook, Acer, Goddess, Blessing, and Power are full. All equipment is plus 15. Shadow equipment is also plus 15. And 50% shadow progress. All equipment, Mora Enchant is at full value. Even a uh, fourth enchant, it will activate to a full value. So this means, um, you know, you have uh, your enchants, right? 
and like these stats suddenly they're going to be maxed so like let's try to see if i could get like a a more obvious stat line what's up front um front z let's see try to get like a stat line that's a little more obvious but oh my god where the heck Anyway, so like if you if you have a if you have like a basic stat line that goes to max ten, it would it would it would be ten as an example. Um, activated skill runes effect value will be maximum, and all lines active attribute runes and arcane runes will be activated to full. So that means all your runes are also like full. Um, all lines are activated. So this also means like if you're a hero. Like, your extra lines are also activated. So you can kind of, like, test out other classes and characters, which is kind of nice for a uh, full firepower mode. Uh, character Oracle Mirror for offensive. Defensive and relics will not take effect. So they'll take out those. Um, it says, under the skills, full firepower talent interface, you can choose to activate, not for offensive. So that, I think, happens when you enter. Um... Oh, wait. Oh, you applied. Okay, sorry. I just realized that. Oh, wait. It won't. It was. Let me get out of matchmaking. Hold on. One thing at a time. I forgot. They cha They changed the way, like, matchmaking works as well. Or something. I think, I think now it won't just remove you from matchmaking. I think now you have to pause it. Uh, manually and then add people and like all kinds of stuff um da, 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 da. so and it says mm, what was the other thing oh and then the other note says currently only these support the mode six is casual 12 casual and seasonal the 3v3 casual and it's optional for for runes okay let me let me bring back this other one <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> Just like, oh yeah, I have to click the other thing to do the other thing and the stuff. <laughs> Alright, so let's 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 see with two people. So we'll just see. We're gonna see how it goes. Um but either way, we can still kinda like talk about PvP and we can um you know theory craft what would be good for you know what what are people thinking for, for threes and all that. What's up? Good morning. <laughs> Let me refine. I mean, I have nothing refined. I don't worry about my CBT now. Like, <laughs> outside of what they give us, like, I have zero shadow. Like, I don't. I'm not. I'm not gonna. Listen, I don't refine on my main account. You think I'm gonna refine on my on my CBT account? That's not happening. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> I just laugh about it because I can't help it. But. For PvP, you know, a lot of people are talking about, is this going to be kind of like a um, a DPS meta? Was it going to be very DPS heavy? Because the the objective in 3v3v3 is to get to 10 points first. And to get to 10 points first is you have to get kills. So... You know what what does that mean or will it mean there's going to be one hyper dps and two supports you know what options and what ideas are people thinking is it going to change based on you know maybe kind of like just the current meta is it going to adapt very quickly are we going to have a lot of options actually you know it's it, there's there's a lot of um a lot of ideas a lot of ideas um, I kind of wish maybe there was like a preview of the map here. It would be nice. It would be nice. But the map itself, um, it looks very much, if you haven't seen it, there was a preview video that was going around. If you haven't seen it, it looks very much like, um, I believe it's called uh, Meteor Forest. It looks very much kind of like the where the quest for Taekwon head off to. It's kind of like that kind of zone. The Bamboo Forest and all that 
and I'm pretty excited about it. It looks really neat so far. I'm just not sure about the map. I want I wanted to see the map because I've only seen pictures of the map. And it's like I feel like especially for PvP, it's it's one of those it's one of those things that until you're in there and you see it in action and you can kind of start strategizing. Because I felt the same way with um like especially like the new GVG map. It's very hard to visualize, I feel, until like you're you're you know, you're you're in there. <laughs> <laughs> you know you're you're in there and you can kind of see see the layout because oh that's right so the other thing about it is when you're in there too is the grassy areas there's basically like a tall grass and when you're in the tall grass actually you're hidden you actually get sort of like a stealth so it should actually be like really really interesting <laughs> <laughs> like as far as far as introducing very interesting new mechanics uh let me see what else was here for notes about it i'm trying to remember what else was noted because i was 100 percent maybe not prepared uh <laughs> yeah so they so you have to get the 10 the the 10 points first i remembered that did i just what was that pop-up <laughs> i have no idea um Oh yeah, the match lasts up to 5 minutes. If no team reaches up to 10 points, the highest points wins. If multiple camps has the same amount of points, the first to reach that amount, amount of points would be the winner. Let's see. There is a note here that says star eyes can monitor the battlefield and will mark different colors dot to assist between teammates and enemies position. I'm not sure what that means exactly. Um, entering the star grass in the arena, your position will be hidden. Only your teammates or enemies in the same grass area can see you. Um, participants can utilize the map and grass for your combat positions. So it seems like a very position, like, your positioning is incredibly important, is what it sounds like for this map in particular. So it says here, the current map has a limited amount of these hiding grass jungles that allow them to hide themselves. Use the terrain to your advantage to make the battlefield more interesting. So even though, you know, and they say, they said in their original notes that even though it might seem simplistic, you know, there's still, there's still strategy to it because you still have to think of where to go, where to hide, when. Because the thing about especially like hide is you can kind of like duck out and try and um what is it called make them lose their target and things of that nature so you have to like think of just things a little differently like in other games and especially MOBAs and things like that you know especially when they have like different game modes and things you have to the gameplay is a little different it is quite different and what is up, Derek, over on YouTube? How are you? Um, is it really, let's see, Loki as on Discord, is it really just first to 10 points mechanic? That's what it says on the original notes, from what I can tell. Okay, so I think it timed out. That's what I think that message was. So we can try again. I forgot what this one was. I forgot what this this note was. Let me let me translate this thing up here. Only match the service. Oh yes, yeah, so I think this says only match the service. I'm not sure if you're able to like queue for separate things at the same time or not. I'm not exactly sure what this checkbox is. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't I don't I don't know what that's referring to. Um <laughs> Yeah, it's the, it's the race to 10 points. 10 points might seem like that's the thing too. And, and I think that's why we're in the testing phase of this map currently is because, you know, is, is 10 points too low? Because, you know, if you get to the 10 points super quickly and the game ends too fast, you know, does that mean, is it too simple? Like, you know, then maybe it needs a little, maybe some type of objective or maybe more 
um, like pillars? Does it need more things on the map to maneuver around? You know, th those are very good questions. Those are very good questions, especially for something that is a PvP map. You know, do you need more things in the way to kind of make it more interesting? For sure, for sure. And yeah, the game and the, the, the game would either would it be uninteresting if everyone was hiding? Would it be you know too fast or this and that? There's definitely a lot of uh, still a lot of questions. Still a lot of questions. And also this is this on the far right is also the recreation of what we have now for making you know like our rooms and all that too. So this is still here, of course. It just looks very different now. <laughs> Everything just looks very different. <laughs> it just looks very fancy. <laughs> What's up, Julian, over, over on YouTube? Very poggers. <laughs> but the map, yeah. So that's the thing is that it sounds really interesting, but you know, until like you see it and you and you're, you know, we start being able to see it in action, strategizing, being able to. Uh, see what is in the map and seeing uh, where where the grass is located because that's the thing too especially for a pvp map is you know where can you you know duck behind things where where is the grass you know in this case i think the big thing is going to be uh where are the grassy fields where can i hide you know where can i duck in and out you know, like I was saying earlier, if you make a team composition with uh, supports, you know, is it going to be a thing where the supports are, um, you know, hiding in the grass more often, you know, sort of deal, you know, but at the same time, then are there going to be compositions of, you know, the DPS going to seek them out? Are there going to be certain parts of the map that are going to be more popular? You know, it's, there's going to be, it's it should be interesting. And since it doesn't have currently any sort of mechanic of grabbing an orb and, you know, uh, how do you say, turtling an objective. Turtling an objective where, you know, you're not, for instance, uh, as an example, like in, in a game like Overwatch where you're, you're camping the the cart or something you know where you're doing that or for instance in rom where you're trying to collect the other orbs while you're holding orbs you know you're you're turtling an objective where you're on that uh specific point you know if there is nothing like that where are you going to find everybody how are you going to seek them out you know it's it's those kind of questions when it comes to some you know a new pvp mode of you know how, how am i going to get my points where is everybody <laughs> Where do we go? <laughs> Let's see. Chaldean says, I think I think with this, uh uh oh my gosh, I can't talk. Cell hunter trappers might become meta. That's an interesting idea. Trappers could come back. Because traps are scary. <laughs> I won't be able to sleep until I see the tall grass. I bet I wonder where the grass were to be. <laughs> asking the real questions. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> that's true. That's true. <laughs> yeah, you know, that's the thing, is, is, is until we, until we, and, and the thing about especially PvP, right? You know, until we memorize the map, we know every single pixel of the gameplay map and where to go, where, you know, where, where, you know, what's, where, where is the grassy knoll at nine o'clock and where's the one at six o'clock, etc., etc. Until we know every single pixel on this map and where to go and where to, you know, strategize and beat up everybody, it's going to be, um... A big question mark of of how to how how to win how 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 do we you know do this and all that so you know we can we can look and think of uh you know which classes uh could make a comeback or you know things like that i actually like the idea of the stellar hunter trapper i think that's a good one actually i actually really i actually really like that idea you know because even um even like begetters, even begetters can just throw stuff in the grass. <laughs> they don't even have to be in there. They could just throw stuff in there. And then the homunculus can just chase them down too. You know, who else can just throw stuff in there? 
I wonder... Thinking. Because, because even Dorums, like the UFOs and some of the stuff can seek things out, right? So I wonder also, because isn't there also like different types of hide, right? So I wonder how exactly that works as well, as far as that goes. So I kind of wonder about that now, like thinking about that out loud. Um, if like the if like the UFOs would seek these people out in the grass, or it, or is it like a different type, you know? <laughs> Let's see. I'm thinking. Let me see. Uh, Loki says I'm thinking that this three v three would have the kill the captain mechanic, and that's the only time you gain a point. That's an interesting idea. That would be fun. Almost like um. I, I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. Like, if so, if someone is, like, the mark or, like, a bounty, if someone is, like, the bounty mark on the field, that would be fun. That sounds actually kind of fun, right? Or if it was, like, if, some, if someone was, like, um, let's say, like, like, what if, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have an idea. I have an idea. <laughs> So like imagine if uh so you know like in something like Apex Legends there's there's something on in the game where someone is called like the kill captain where someone has like the most kills in the game so like what if someone on the field had like a kill spree right and then suddenly they became the bounty mark and maybe they were worth more points and then what if and then what if one of the the other teams took them down and they got like a bonus point for taking them down or something like that like i wonder if that could be like a catch-up or something like that would be kind of interesting like i feel i feel like they could be like different ways or maybe even like different modes like i kind of like the I, I like the idea of like a bounty mode like what if it like rotated or what if you had to, like, capture a certain person or something? <laughs> write that down. Write that down. <laughs> it's like, wait. See, we're really... It's, it, this is really just <laughs> a theory crafting stream now. <laughs> it makes the saint the captain. Yeah, because if you, if you choose a captain, then I feel like you could probably, like, really stack up. Um you know something but if it was something that could be rotated or if there was like something like a bounty mark i think that could be very interesting i think that could make it actually quite interesting <laughs> let's see yeah 10 points is interesting and 10 kills is easy yeah it's, it's hard to say like you know is is 10 kills you know does it does it need more points or should points be in a different way? You know, it's it's definitely um a couple of things to to uh, think about for sure. There could be a bounty breach team. It could rotate. <laughs> point of, actually, point of view support when you see your DPS. Yeah, that's basically me. You'd be. <laughs> or make the respawn time higher. Yeah, I feel like there's a couple of of ways that you could go about it. Um. Uh. Yeah, because if you if you die too often, it could it could be increased spawn timers or um, something like that. There, there could be a couple of ideas. There could be a couple of um, ideas there for sure. I kind I kind I don't know. I'm kind of digging that bounty thing though. <laughs> um, or like, cause I I I I also like um like simple. Not not simple, but I like um, modes of like capture the flag, and I feel like not that this is in that direction, but you know, I feel I feel like I don't know. We're close. <laughs> We're close. <laughs> I feel like I feel like we can get there. We can get there. <laughs> you know, I like I like those kind of like sort of things of just. Just fun, fun kind of back and forth. You know, I kind of like the little like skirmishes. I like the idea of little skirmishes. <laughs> What's up, Alex? How are you on YouTube side? <laughs> <laughs> what 
what what if there's like a node in woe or map three and you need to take a node to gain a point yeah like like or maybe um or maybe because because the thing is like for instance in um or if there was uh what's it called oh my god i can't think of words <laughs> please be patient <laughs> Overtime. Okay, so I'm trying to think of the word overtime. So, because I'm trying to think in uh, in uh, Final Fantasy XIV, they have a they have a mode called uh, Crystalline Conflict. It's also a five minute mode. It's it's a simple mode of um, you do this thing where you go back and forth trying to push. It's it's just a push cart mechanic. It's very simple. Um, but the thing is, there's a thing called overtime. If you don't, if no one pushes the cart to the opposite side within five minutes, there's an overtime. So I was, I was trying to think like that node mechanic could be a good overtime mechanic. Like instead of saying whoever gets the points first, like maybe there could be like whoever captures like this node first or takes or wipes out the other teams first or something like if there was like a like a final round sort of mode like maybe or maybe like a max of like because i feel like they want to have something that isn't too um that that isn't going to be 10 to 15 minutes right it's not it's not going to be 10 to 15 minutes for example so like I, I can understand that part, but if let's say we had like an extra minute or two of like an overtime mode of like capturing a node or be like maybe the next to get like the next point or two or wipe out or wipe out the other team or maybe if there was a chance to, you know, catch up or something. It'd be very, very interesting. <laughs> I just want to announce it to comment on the on the killing streak. Double kill triple kill yeah i mean that would be fun <laughs> that's what we need we need voice packs <laughs> first blood yeah that's what we need <laughs> good morning <laughs> uh, be... <laughs> we need we need the little pouring we need king pouring to <laughs> we need the king pouring voice packs <laughs> What's up, Toss Toss? How are you? <laughs> What's up, everybody? Yeah, like, like, oh, because overtime mode is also not an unusual thing that we see, like, in other PvP modes and other games and stuff. It's kind of like a, a final round, right? You know, there's a couple of ways that you can go about, because that's the thing, right? Like, there's, like, there's a lot of games of PvP or, like, you know, a versus mode. Let's, let, let's go with versus. You know, like I was just saying, like, uh, like Crystal Conflict is is a push the cart mechanic. Like you could have something like that, and and obviously you, you know, we beat up each other, right? Trying to do that, <laughs> you know, and something like Apex is an FPS, so you know, you 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 do it that way. You know, there's a lot of there's a lot of different versus modes that you can like try to go with, right? So it's kind of interesting that you know this is just kind of like a. A simple mode with with you know the the grass and you try and maneuver um you know that's the thing is is that's why this seems to be it's supposed to be kind of like a quick skirmish that's you know i could definitely tell by just the basic rule set it's definitely meant to be a quick game but you know you know sh should it have other objectives or mechanics to it um or will it you know uh stand for itself will it stand for itself you know with its map and everything that it has to offer because from the map that i have which i i didn't i didn't save any i didn't prepare anything for this uh <laughs> the map that i saw um it's actually uh like a round map which i think you can move around so you know something i asked was you know something someone said is why isn't it like a triangle map because it's not um, you you would think it would be, but I think it's because maybe they want us to have the ability to to move around the map. But then, um, but then the question is, what about your spawns? Then is there a disadvantage to where you're spawning? If that's the case, um, and I think that's also a big question. If you know, if uh, if where you spawn on the map also matters as well. Because, because that's the thing with versus modes is that there's a there's a lot, you know there's a, there's a lot to versus modes in games, you know there's there's a lot to consider when it comes to um you know these sorts of things. Uh, I, I, 
<laughs> because because like uh i remember what was it even with 12s right i remember you know we used to say um it was rough when you spawned at either top or bottom it felt like it felt you know when when we were stuck in locked mode it, it felt either a bit rough right if we remember that when the map first came out so you know that's something to consider maybe depending on where we spawn on the map you know is it is it going to feel tough also depending on which camera mode you're on you know there could be some opinions there there's some there's some stuff to think about and, and that's why we have to test these things and check them out <laughs> what's up dear chan uh xp every 15 minutes yes so starting this week they started adding um xp to the streamer channels over on the official discord so yeah if you come hang hang out with all with all us streamers um yeah come hang out with us all of us <laughs> come have a good time and you know and everything everyone's everyone's been everyone's been meeting everybody <laughs> i have a lot of guildies who are like oh man i've never watched this person before but i had a good time listening to them today you know like like i know everyone's getting xp but everyone's like like meeting some i've seen like screenshots from other people i'm like this is really cool i thought it was really fun <laughs> perfect with coffee yeah just hang out and vibe <laughs> Uh, Julian, so I love that if it can be translated in the in-game voice language, so I don't know which thing you're referring to exactly. But perfect with coffee. Yeah, I mean, just just hang it in vibe. Just hang it in vibe. <laughs> we're just we're just gonna hang out, hang out in rom. <laughs> Have fun watching me. Um, you can find me on my YouTube. Uh, let me grab the. The link i really should you know what it is too is that so this is my first time streaming with my new setup i file i know listen i'm finally adapting to 2024 i'm finally adapting everybody i have big news i finally got a second monitor i know i know big news big news friends <laughs> So, <laughs> I know, I know, I've been streaming, I've been streaming for four years with one monitor, I know. <laughs> Trust me, I know more than everybody here. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm like, I'm trying to think of like what I need to do next time to like make it easier. <laughs> so give me... <laughs> I'm like trying to think right now. <laughs> I'm like trying to like think to myself. I'm like, what to what to do and like grab next time for like browser tabs and things. But it's definitely a little easier. Ha 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 So this is so this is actually uh, so that's uh, the live stream that's going on right now. But that'll bring you directly to my YouTube channel as well, which you can also find uh, my other guides and videos and all that kind of stuff. And all of that jazz. <laughs> because we talk about all kinds of nonsense. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> One monitor, yeah. <laughs> I used to complain about it all the time. <laughs> well, not really complain. I was used to it. I was used to it. It's not a big deal. I used to say I used to say I stream on hard mode. Okay, listen, I just I'm just hardcore. All right, I was just hardcore. Okay, <laughs> but no, yeah, the whole time I've been because I've I've been streaming since con con fairly consistently since 2020, and yeah, <laughs> so it's pretty funny. How do you work with one monitor? I mean. We've had we've we've had one monitor since since the nineties, so you know. I have a death <laughs> I can't even work with two monitors. Yeah, I know. Maybe maybe it'll take me another like ten years or something. <laughs> let me check let me see on YouTube. Um let's see. <clears throat> Um, Ash asks, uh, my Elga should have Witch of Calamity or Moonlight Tangerine card. I can't decide. Um, Witch of Calamity is really good. If you don't have Witch of Calamity, I would highly suggest getting at least one. Um, I'm not sure if you need two. 
I'm I I don't know if I can answer that question, but I would highly suggest getting a Witch of Calamity star uh star card. Oh my god, um a Witch <laughs> a Witch of Calamity card. Um, I did pick up one for myself because I also have like uh, other magic specs. So for me, it was a very good investment. But I use Witch of Calamity for like my elf, um, for my um, magic dorum, for my nidhog. Uh, what else? <laughs> every everything any any anywhere i can i think witch of calamity is a, is a good end game investment um if you have the option but moonlight tangeline uh star card is a very good budget option if it's if which is just not within your reach right now i think i you know i was i was rocking the moonlight tangeline cards forever as far as that goes you know but i think which which is a very good uh goal to have for sure yeah, uh, Keldian on, on Discord says, like, it's always snapping in EL. It's, on global side, there's usually only, like, one up or it's snapping. So, like, it's usually, you know, it's it's a very desirable card for a reason. <laughs> for sure. For sure. You know, it's a very good card. So I would, I would definitely say, you know, try, you know, consider it for sure. A hundred percent. hundred million percent. <laughs> But yeah, you know, there's there's a lot there's a there's a lot of cards now. <laughs> I have I have fifty seven point five. I I I am not able to do like a stats offhand. I would. <laughs> so the thing is, like, um, at least, uh, let's say. So like the. So with the static groups like I run with, especially for PVE um, and like our philosophies and like stuff like that, um, we actually do very kind of like old, I don't know if I want to say old style, but kind of like classic style MMO gaming uh, damage weights uh, where we actually test uh, what's called like damage weights or damage effectiveness in order to see what is the next what is the best stat to upgrade in your current time you know based on your current gear and etc cetera, etc cetera. so you know it's funny when people say like uh what should i get next or this and that um you know because my 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 per my my opinion is always like well it's kind of based on your character and your current progress and what you have stacked with your current gear etc cetera, etc cetera. You know, some some people go with, well, I have a low amount of this stat, so maybe I should spruce it up. It's sometimes not that simple. Um, it's a little more complicated. Um, I actually wanted to work on, well, I have a lot of video ideas and concepts and stuff. What's up? Um, that... <laughs> I work on uh, one of them right now is actually I did want to work on um, talking about damage and increasing damage is actually a video script that I was working on so I kind of want to touch on that a little bit so I'm not sure how much interest there is in that but it is one of those topics that I felt like it might be good to to I don't know discuss and stuff you know there's always like 50 million scripts I have whether or not I finished the video as a different story. <laughs> I see people too. Yeah, some people do use too. Um, you know, that's the thing is that, you know, some people stack crit, some people don't. I know, for instance, that, um, you know, I, I know someone that tested with their elf this week, swapping out like a shell pet card for a different card in airship this week. And they notice a pretty dramatic difference, but that's based on like their tune. You like you know what I mean? Like I can't say like oh well they did this so this should be the meta. Like I, I don't think that's like a fact or anything like that. I don't think it works that way. <laughs> you know I I don't I don't find it that simple of an answer, as far as that goes. So as far as that goes, Alex no it was it was uh if if you're curious it was Duskin. Duskin was testing LOD cards, um, so. As far as that goes, <laughs> because I run, it's funny because I, I tell people like I do my airship and then people get confused because I run with two elves and a Rathcracy. 
<laughs> and people get a little confused at what I'm talking about, but that's how I do my airship because I run, I run with my friends. I don't I don't do meta groups. I just want to run statics with my friends. <laughs> so I don't I don't we don't really worry about like you know, we just we just run with what we run to run. And as long as it works, it doesn't matter. <laughs> We're actually talking about, um, he might actually try Dorm again, so. <laughs> you know, as a, I, and you know, it is what it is. 15? No, we do 15. So we do 15 SSS. Every week. <laughs> Unless it's like a really tough week and it's like double S. But we always do at least double S. There's, I don't, I don't think there's, uh, let's see. I think maybe there's only like one week we did like a 14 because 15 was just terrible. That, but that was like months ago or something. You know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. As long as long as it's fifteen triple S, I it doesn't matter. And I do record the runs and stuff. So people have actually asked me. They're like, you know, I would like to see your runs, and I'm like, I I just don't know if it's that interesting because I'm just I'm just I'm just a baby saint, so you know. <laughs> but uh, but I, I I would like to share the runs because I do think it's interesting to show different compositions. So I I would like to start uploading them actually. <laughs> you know, it is fun to share um different perspectives and stuff. You know that work <laughs> stream it i will i will not i mean i mean our, an airship run is like six minutes i'm not gonna stream for six minutes you know <laughs> i'm not gonna stream for six minutes stream my run. I mean I don't have to stream like we, we like we do a party and then like we're done we're, we're done in like 10 minutes like it's 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 you know unless it's like a really weird week like you know unless it's like a really um like what was it this week or last week like last week we had deny like some like sometimes a week like that might take like like an extra pull like you know just if something if something happens <laughs> it's like whoops because I think we had Zenubia we had Zenubia, and you know how Zenubia just one-shots people? <laughs> Zenubia is mean. <laughs> the bosses are mean. Everyone knows this, right? They're just mean to us. So you know how it goes. <laughs> I, I appreciate Keldy and Chad goes, Ugh. I feel that. I felt that. <laughs> But I do, I do, I do, uh, I do record them on my end. So, so if, if it's, it seems like there's a interest. I did, I did, uh, I did upload one of my airships that, uh, but I have, I just, I just don't upkeep it. I don't know. It's just, it's just, it's a me problem, <laughs> but I'll start doing it. It just seems like people are interested. So I'll, I'll start doing it then. Okay. 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 <laughs> I promise I'll, I'll start doing it. <laughs> But, uh, <laughs> but I'm not sure if you guys saw, um, I did have also the, the other CVT sneak peek video and everything that there was some other like UI stuff going on. Um, oh yeah, someone asked me a question in my comments. Let me see something. So they have this new UI for the refine and enchantment. So someone asked me in a YouTube comment about because this is like the enchant screen. So you can enchant everywhere and you get the uh, discount from your home, which is really good. But they asked me, they said, well, we don't have access to the enchant shop. And I was like, I think you're right. <laughs> because we, we, cause we had the whole enchant interface and I was like, shoot, I think you're right. I don't see it here anymore. So I'm like, well then. Well, at least I can remove my cards now. So I guess that's uh, that's something. So I don't know. I think I'll get some feedback about that. <laughs> okay, I'm the saint. I can't carry you. You carry me. <laughs> Wee. You're so pretty. <laughs> But yeah, if we do, if we can't get um if we can't get a queue going um in a bit uh not a huge deal. I did try to to give a shout out for people to let them know that I was gonna do this, but um not a huge deal. Uh, but we could still theory craft. Um, I could do some Kaltzberg stuff, or if anyone else uh wants to do some other things on CBT, we can do that as well. 
Tell your party to carry me. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> the chant was on. Yeah, so so it is um uh let me see. Wait, it didn't used to be here. Is it not hit there at all anymore? Is the new job so currently on CBT we have uh, let me make here again. I think it's because it's like nine in the morning over there. Uh, so probably not many are, are looking to battle. Um, so currently on CBT we have Fenrir, cute. Cute fluffy boy Fenrir. And then we have Kalsberg. Which is some else. Uh <laughs> so we do have both Fenrir and Kalsberg on um CBT. Um I did already do um a Kalsberg stream. So if you want to check that out, I already did that. Actually. So I already did like a full overview. I, I think Fenrir looks really good. I think it looks pretty cool. But at the same time, then Kalsberg is like, Kalsberg looks really good. <laughs> yeah, like for, I'm like I'm like wait a minute, like Francis, I'm like wait, it's not even here anymore. Now I'm now I'm like kind of concerned. Now I'm like wait, where's my shop? <laughs> cause that cause cause yeah, it used to be here. <laughs> where's my shop? What if I want to go shopping? What if I go shop? Because I do, because because I do like to just buy Mora where I am, you know. So, uh, like a spe like especially for the, um, mm, the transfer. Actually, is it in that part of the? Of the mm, let me see something. So they have the headwear thing here, which I'm gonna guess if you have access in your guild, this shows up. I don't know otherwise. Unless they're changing something with the sewing machine. So, let me see. Hold on, having a moment. Where's we're fine? Wait, let me let me just do a regular refine. Then I, then I won't be so confused. <laughs> All right, there's refine. Okay, so because we used to have the tabs so then do we have to oh my God. so then where where do i go <laughs> where do i go do we have to go to to okay so this okay so if i go to the npc it's here yeah no i mean i know there's the cat but okay so if i go to this this shows up but like now i have to go back to the npc Where, where's my where's my mobile shop where's my mobile shop okay it's because so this stuff is still here so from this store i do have access to the shop here at this npc but this interface doesn't seem to have it <laughs> And it does look like it was taken out of the actual inventory area, so... Uh-huh. Make... Make, yeah, make the NPCs great again, apparently, I guess. It goes to Geffen? Oh my gosh. Yeah, because, I mean, the, the cat was the original shop, for sure. The cat was definitely... Yeah, because... <laughs> the cat was, was the original... Remember we had to do the quest? Remember we had to do the quest? I actually had someone ask me, well, not me actually. I actually saw someone asking about the cat quest. Remember we had the different enchantment tiers? Like we had uh, the basic and the advanced um, enchantments we had to unlock. <laughs> I saw the question online and I, and I was like trying to explain. I'm like, no, 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 no. It's just, it's just enchantment now. We don't do that anymore. <laughs> Just, just enchant. It's okay. It's all right. Don't worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. You're, you're allowed to get fourth enchants now. Intermediate. That's what it was. 
that's what it was like toss 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 intermediate that's what it there was like basic intermediate advanced it was three there was like three three series of quests that we had to like we had to go uphill both ways to get our enchantments done <laughs> it's so funny <laughs> oh my god oh my gosh <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. Oh, man. <laughs> so, so hacking funny. But, uh, but yeah, I mean, that's the thing is that so much has changed and, you know, there, there's a lot of, like, older info and I, I felt bad. I'm like, no, 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 it's not relevant anymore. <laughs> it's not relevant anymore. <laughs> I always feel bad because I think it's like confusing. I'm like, no. <laughs> oh man, look at this laser sword. That's cute. Kind of matches with the green. Oh, I like that. That's cool. <laughs> you had to do a four count? Oh no. <laughs> yeah, I remember there was like a whole strategy of like, um, yeah, the intermediates were cheaper, right? I think because it costs like a little less mora or something. So funny. <laughs> so, 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 so funny. But, but, uh. <laughs> but especially like with the old, uh, the old quests of, um. What was the other one? It was the like the old advancement quest we had to do in the guild hall for oh breakthrough breakthrough that's what I'm thinking of. There was breakthrough and then there was the um the what is it called uh death's breath with the original like I don't know the original like like things with the the undead bosses the revenant bosses and everything we had to collect and all that stuff with the i think it was the f5 update <laughs> and all that stuff the devil wing quest devil wing quest was actually pretty cool though <laughs> it was definitely like a journey right <laughs> You know, because you had to be like, all right, where's the special MVP? Which which week is this? Is this Chimera? Is this the Dracula week? Oh my god. I, I missed last week. Now I gotta wait another three weeks. Oh my god. Here we go again. <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think I think this this that skill's actually pretty cool. I think Fenrir is actually I, I think this is gonna be weird if I start changing class. But um but I think Fenrir like looks really good. But Calisper looks like really really good. <laughs> no. <laughs> Culvert. Culvert, you know, oddly enough, unironically, Culvert is actually kind of crazy, like it still has like the instant spawn areas um you can still like throw something there to to just like just farm like zenny like you know especially like low level characters some people still do like the alt farming i've noticed at least on global i've definitely noticed a lot of people uh farming sometimes in older areas and all that still so it's kind of funny <laughs> Sometimes I'm in those older maps. I, 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 do, I do what I like to call my lazy farms. Sometimes I'll go to old maps um, and, I, and I, uh, I just farm at a high kill rate for either materials or as any. I just sometimes, listen, sometimes I just, I, I don't want to talk to the cat. I don't want to talk to the cat to find move speed. I don't want to jump channels. I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to go to mirror realm. I just, I just want to turn on my offline. And I want to go to bed. So I'll just go to an older map and vibe <laughs> and I'll just, and I'll just, you know, it's, it's not, it's not optimal farm, but it's a farm. It's whatever. So I'll do it. <laughs> so it's funny. Cause I'll see, I'll see these older, or not older, but I'll see like these little alts and stuff farming. 
and all that and and i farm in those areas too I, i'll just run the mats i just farm it at a lesser rate but i'll just farm at a very high kill rate so i still get some stuff they'll remove the drop rate penalty for level gaps right now there's been no announcement about that whatsoever we've requested but it's been rejected in the past at the meetings so i don't think it's going to happen for the honeys yeah i i, I do a lot of honey farm yeah i do a lot of honey farm <laughs> I just do it. I just do it on my on my max character. I don't really care. <laughs> but yeah, I don't think they're gonna change. So the so the thing so the thing with that actually, if you think about it, with the um, the drop rate thing, is they put the material thing into rips, right? So you can, you know, it it's not the same thing sort of but i feel like this is the only other like way that you kind of like circumvent the the drop rate is you know using these material things is uh the marks where you can get older items like if you need older items you could technically use rips to get these older items now quite frankly you can um and it is also a valid method also of earning zenny you know, of just burning your CT, or if you don't have offline, it's it's also actually pretty good. Um, as far as that goes. <laughs> you know, for instance, um, this, you know, and the, let's see, where is it? Because I, I, I do it too. Sometimes I just do the first three. Usually the first three is like a bonus to get the, like, MVP material too. Usually a lot of people do the level, either level 100 farms, or you do like the max ones for uh, materials. You know, this it, it's perfectly valid to get materials this way. This this is kind of the only thing, like, I think you can perceive it as ignoring drop penalty. And black market. Right, but I mean, as far as earnings, any. Like, if you want to earn any with older materials... Uh, Rift is a good way to uh, a good method. My ult contribute to the market by selling low level mass. We need supply, right? Which, which you know, you can't technically do with with. You could technically do with CT, but yeah, you know, obviously, raw Zenny or Soul Hunting Grounds farm is obviously better, but you do have the option of rifts. So I think I think that's the only like thing. That's the only option or realistic option that we have at this point <clears throat> can does give a buff to, to the job slayer hopefully i don't think there's anything been announced or, or uh you know touched on it um at this time so we can we can only hope and pray <laughs> and all that stuff <laughs> What is up on YouTube said? What's up, Kermizi? How are you? <laughs> yeah, I didn't do the wheel yet. So I, I plan to do a video. I didn't do the video yet. <laughs> so I just have to deal. At least I'm at least on my screen. I just have to deal with the, with the red dot for now. <laughs> I think with the the stream layout, no one else has to deal with it. <laughs> I never sell material. I'm a hardcore holder, ho uh, hoarder. Lizzie says, "Oh my gosh." <laughs> I I usually I I hoard quite a bit of materials, but I also like making zenny. So, it's kind of, it's kind of hit or miss. I say I save some materials, and then um, yeah, it, it just kind of depends. It kind of depends on on my needs and wants at the time. Sometimes um, another method also, if you need materials. Trying to find it. I have to reckon. Oh wait, wait, wait. I think it's an inventory. I have to recognize it because I have to like sift through this inventory, which is a huge mess on this CBT. Is the um also the sin crystals that you can get from void? I don't know what they are. <laughs> anyway, if you get the sin crystals, that's also a method of getting materials for yourself or to sell as well is also something you can do that is another way to get you know 
materials out there if you wanted to do that. Um, because you could you could just kill the regular mobs. You could just kill the the regular mobs to get all uh, the sync crystals. You don't even have to kill any any MVPs whatsoever. Yeah, encourage this word. I know. Oh, what's up, Demuse? How are you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I hoard a lot of stuff, honestly. I hoard a lot of stuff. It's so funny. If I'm on if I'm on my main account, I still have um I still have like the, the old rift grails. If you use the old rift grails, they turn into um adventure like the adventure rice balls or whatever now. Uh I don't care. You can't make me. <laughs> you can't make me. <laughs> you can't make me do it. <laughs> you can't make me. And so, unless you make it auto use, you can't. <laughs> you can't make me do it. <laughs> a lot of stuff i still have the like the old uh doom and Mor Moroc event currency i have a lot of event currency event currency i don't get rid of i either use it or i just save it i don't get rid of anything there was something else i have i don't remember now there's also um if you do like the zodiac um like uh like mace uh is it mesa no not mesa that's not her name bell dandy uh bell dandy in frontera when you do the zodiac um she can also give you rare items so some of the rare items is also actually rare scrolls uh, so i remember early on i had gotten i had i had actually gotten a scroll to turn into mesa i actually also have a scroll to turn into the ufo cat i just favorited them i never use them i still have not used them to this day so, <laughs> it's, I just, I, it's like it's like one of those things where it's like oh man maybe i'll use it for like a video i still haven't used them i still haven't used them they're still scrolls to this day <laughs> yeah the fortune child and I, i'm still missing some zodiac poses i really need to just like do them and just do them <laughs> oh what's up is the skill shot Oh, you know what's great? You know what's great on CBT? I get to use the Pringles emote. <laughs> I get to use the Pringles emote. It's so exciting. <laughs> it's, it's, they had some kind of collab over there or something. I was I was gonna a kick out of it. <laughs> to unlock all the zodiac poses. <laughs> yeah, I, I couldn't. I couldn't. I, I apparently couldn't drag him long enough to do it. I have to get someone else to do. It. <laughs> King pouring is also yeah. King pouring. King pouring is hoarding all the MVP cards. Unbelievable. Oh wait, let me let me check something real quick. So they changed they changed the the Prentera King pouring. I think I showed that last time. Did they change this one? I don't remember. I don't think I checked. Oh no, this one's the same. Interesting. So this one still has all the options. The Prantera one is split into three functions for some reason. It's split, um... For a second I thought there was like an error. I was like, what happened now? <laughs> Anytime I have a pop-up on CBT, I get scared. I'm like, what is it telling me? Because I have no idea. <laughs> Here it is. Yes, yeah, so, because the king pouring on CBT right now, so we might see this in the future. When you go to king pouring, he only has, um, like, combined fate. And then the deviling does the, the dusting get dusted and then uh angeling has the two functions to re-roll and craft now so i'm not sure why <laughs> i couldn't tell you why 
I don't know. <laughs> I should make King Porn the world MVP in Frontera. Oh no, he's second to Hulk hit on the hit list. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Poor King Poring. I didn't think about that. Like, I know everyone gets mad at Holkerhan, but it's like, man, who would be number two? Like, I think I think Holkerhan is easily everyone's number one. But like who who is everyone's like like number two or like top three? <laughs> you know, like <laughs> ROM NPCs that like Let's see, what's what's something that's not like too violent? What <laughs> top three NPCs you want to throw into the Frontera jail or something? <laughs> Number two is Grandpa Holgren and Juno. <laughs> Number three is Holgren and the other town. I understand. I hear you. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think I see where you're going with this. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Let's see, is anyone else online actually? Oh, there's a couple of us. Oh my gosh, I forgot this is like shorter here. Oh, let's just, I don't know, I'm just gonna say it in the guild chat for now. It's like, it's like, wait, there's some people online. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, maybe that's, oh, you know what? I think that's, maybe that's like the Imperium message. I'm just not used to it. <laughs> it's like, wait a second. Because I think I, I'm like, wait a second, I think that's what it's saying, because it's saying plus one. <laughs> I think people are donating. <laughs> it's probably something like that. That's so funny. It's like the messages we're used to, but like not. <laughs> Let's see. Um. Oh my god, dude. We were still in the honeymoon phase of ROM marriage. Our dates were holding hands for music. And the fortune telling thing almost every day. Oh my god, Demi, that is so cute. I'm done. <laughs> that is so cute. That is absolutely adorable. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> True villain. These are all villains. <laughs> Your own luck. That is hysterical. Oh no. The Ferris will achievement. Yeah, there's a lot- there's a lot of, like, little date achievements, right? I don't think I even have, like, all of them or most of them. It's so funny. I wonder- I don't think there's any- any restrictions on the... ...something. Because I know they started to do some... Restrictions on classes. Nah, it doesn't say anything about classes. I was trying to think, I'm like, is it gonna be an issue of like nine people? He was Kalitzberg, but it doesn't say anything about it. So I check I check the tooltip on like I use Yandex usually for on the fly translating. Um it just says like the it it uh it just says it's a confrontation mode, the camp that takes the lead in defeating ten enemies. Um, if no one gets 10 points, whoever got the highest, uh, score first at the end of the match wins. And it just, it just talks about, like, the grass, uh, gives you hide and stuff. That's basically all it talks about. It just gives, like, the basics of the map. <laughs> That's what the tooltip's talking about. Yeah, we we'll wake up. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't too sure about the timing, but... I tried, I tried to do a call out for the for the overseas peeps, but that's okay. 
we can still talk about um you know like i said the the new full full power fire mode <laughs> and everything else in theorycraft i i still like that idea about the, the stellar hunter we had earlier i like the idea of maybe um like dorum or other things like that um you know different ways to pick off other classes you know, and then, you know, which, you know, is there going to be, like, a side easier to pick off, maybe based on the spawn, or, um, you know, this and that. Let me look at the, the, the things, and this and that. Things and this and that. PDs? Yeah, Phantom Dancer would be nice. What's up? You miss me, or are you talking to someone else? <laughs> like, me? Where did I go? Well, I did have issues that other time. Sorry, no. <laughs> it's been a minute. <laughs> I figured, I figured out what the issue was. I, you know, it's it's always one of those things where, you know what, you know, I, I met Alex on YouTube because I can read. No, I can't read anything. I just I, give me a break. Can't. I just. Oh, you know what it is? Is that I think I think I know where he is on the pod right now. Um, <laughs> I just I'm just like I'm just like wait a second. I know this message. I've seen it a million times. <laughs> um, but it's just in, like if we look if we look at the at the job screen and think of like what might make an impact, you know, because I feel like things that can go on the field like dorm stuff, um. Maybe be getter. You know, it's so funny. Like, Ninja is one of those things I've never touched. But every time I'm versus one, I feel like they just beat the hell out of me. <laughs> like, anytime, anytime, I, anytime I'm versus, like, a ninja, I'm dead. Like, I'm like, oh, it's a ninja. Oh. Okay. Um... <laughs> You know, because the one the ones they know how to play ninja really know how to play ninja. Like the ones that stuck with ninja really know how to play ninja. <laughs> like, <laughs> so I find ninja like a little scary because it's <laughs> because I know I know like uh, magic ninja has like um has some scary stuff. So I'm kind of oh, I clicked the wrong thing. <laughs> So I kind of wonder about that one. I kind of wonder about that one. Like, let's think for a second. Like, what about... Like, what about Nidhogg? So, like, if I think about something like Nidhogg, right? So Nidhogg isn't... Nidhogg is... I, everyone debates it, but whatever. Okay, so Nid, Nidhogg is a hybrid, okay? Nidhogg is a hybrid. I look at Nidhogg as something similar to a disciplined priest from WoW. Okay, that's my interpretation of the job class. So she offers shields, and she offers DPS. So I wonder if, like, a Nidhogg hiding in the grass, boosting a DPS, I wonder if, like, that's, like, something to consider um, as, like, a new role for Nidhogg. I wonder if she could be something in threes, or maybe not, you know? Because, you know, Nidhogg was, I know, tried for sixes and wasn't considered optimal um but i wonder if maybe she could make i don't know maybe maybe an option here maybe it's something to, to think about maybe it's something to think about i would really like to see more hello i really love hello i am 100 percent biased 100 <laughs> percent biased though i really i've loved hello since day one i know i have like like i think like like three videos on her and like and like uh i don't know like a live stream like i you can really tell when i really like something because i won't stop like talking about them <laughs> um i really like hella i would like to see hella i think i wonder if hella might be good to like uh stifle the other team if she can just take the other dps's stats down you know kind of like try and halt them down that would be interesting you know if we think about things like that I wonder if like Gunslinger can make a little bit of a comeback in something like threes. You know, Gunslinger does have some some stuff and some feel to throw on on the ground. 
um, maybe popping out or having the AoEs come out of the grass. I Because, you know, thinking about the grass, I wonder if... <laughs> What's with you guys in your memes? Why are you so fast with your memes? What the hell? I just said that like two seconds ago. <laughs> <laughs> you meme makers over here they're making memes over in discord in like two seconds flat jesus speed running um <laughs> you know maybe something like gunslinger no it would be interesting to see a few a few a few comebacks a few comebacks I think I think what would be hysterical is something like uh even like performers performers just like hiding <laughs> hiding and then just destroying people stepping into the grass actually sounds hilarious as well <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, true. A lot of people uh, do say like Nidhogg doesn't have the weapon. Uh, you know, maybe it's something they could consider to to add for her. But currently, it doesn't seem like there's any plans. Holgrahan also technically they they what they added the synth to an older weapon, right? But I guess technically he still did get his his own weapon in the end. Even Holgrahan got a weapon. <laughs> <laughs> oh no yeah the day Nidhogg gets a weapon like that's it she's gonna she's gonna she's too strong of a dragon <laughs> oh my god laughing like, laughing at this meme looking at <laughs> my screen it's too funny but I definitely think it would be it would be very interesting to see maybe some comebacks or, or different ideas of, you know, seeing uh, what's possible. Fenrir, I actually think, might actually be good for threes, personally. I think that would be interesting. Because I wonder if, if Jorm might actually get picked off in a three situation. Because I know, I know, I know it's Jorm. I know. I know. Trust me. I know. I know. You don't have to tell me. I know it's Jorm. But, you know, I wonder if, like, in a three situation, if he could be picked off more easily if there's two teams versus, like, the team with Jorm, you know. Or not. I don't know. It's Jorm. So it's hard to say right now. <laughs> um, you know, because Jorm, it's, it's basically Jorm versus the world that's literally the world eater. Um but uh, but i kind of like the idea if i wonder like you know because i'm all, i'm always trying to find reasons to use nidhogg i actually do use nidhogg um like on my cml runs and stuff i actually find her like really good for um you know since she is like a hybrid she she doesn't replace saint 100 percent does not replace the full support role is not a full tps role either um but is really good is really good as like a like i said a hybrid is really good if she's also really good if you're in a party that doesn't need a saint like if you're just doing like your basic weeklies and you know like oh we're just doing like you know br and purgatory and you're just kind of rolling through you know the basic stuff for the day um you know, I find Nidhogg really good for that because, you know, you don't necessarily need a full support saint for everything, you know, but I find Nidhogg good for those situations personally. Um, and, you know, I find her as just really good sub DPS and support for, you know, supporting the party in, uh, especially for PvE at least. Uh, let's see, there's Kalitzburg, let's see. And uh, you, he, he does stuff too. <laughs> Heinrich, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I'm always, I'm always like iffy on Heinrich because like he does like a few very good moves and he's very good at it. But for me, my opinion on Heinrich is like he's just too niche and I don't know too much about his things to like really give like a true opinion about it. But it could be interesting if, depending on how things evolve, if he finds a place. 
you know that's really how how uh, how it all comes about right or i wonder if like thanatos would come back to pick off uh people as well because early when thanatos came out like he was just picking off people back and forth um but you know a few things have changed a few extra um you know you know he he picked off supports and people kind of like easily but a lot of things have changed a lot of extra skill damage reduction things have come out so i don't know you know because we haven't seen him in i don't know <laughs> he's still he's still like he's still present like i still see him around but not i feel like definitely not as often her weapon is who she links to i guess that's a one way to look at it being able to transform yeah imagine being like a like a like a super dragon that'd be cool and what i was gonna say before is also uh one thing about the hiding grass is that what would be interesting is if um whether or not performing an action in the grass also temporarily reveals you because something i was thinking about is from league of legends is that when when you when you hide in the grass on the side on the lanes you know, you can kind of duck in and out, or when you hit things from the grass, I'm pretty sure you're revealed for, like, a 0.5 second or something, right? I don't know, it's been, like, 50 years. Uh, but it's, like, something like that. So I'm kind of wondering how the grass uh, gameplay works. And that's also something to consider. Like I said, when you're ducking in and out and using that hiding mechanic and how well it works and how, and how to use it effectively. It's really about the effectiveness, um, like I said, as far as, like, the PvP gameplay goes. Secondary, yeah, exactly. Secondary support and DPS. <laughs> yeah, Nidhogg, I was all in on Nidhogg. I was very excited. Because, I mean, for me, like, I main Saint, and I'm like, oh, man, it's, this is the Saint hero, so this is my hero. So, I mean, I still really love my Nidhogg. I, I upkeep it. Um, I bring her where I can. But I also like bringing, like, other stuff randomly. Like, <laughs> This week I brought Hella for like my so every every week I do my like my guild um like CML law style PSR runs. And this this week I did two runs like as Hella for fun. <laughs> um like a TPS Hella for fun. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, for a second I was like, did I just break it? Now there's three people. <laughs> it's like, oh boy, here we go. <laughs> here we go again. Yeah, exactly. How does vision work when attacking um, inside the bush, outside the bush? Um, is there any kind of, uh, you know, stipulations? Any kind of mechanics? things like, like that would true sight relic work on the grass that's a really good question i have no idea <laughs> that's actually a really good question i didn't think about that i've never had true sight in my life so i would i would i, I would never think that way <laughs> man does my relic work on them? i didn't even think about that but that's actually a really good question i mean i would imagine that i'm trying to think oh you... let me see something because there was notes about the full pyre, full, full, full fire power mode. Uh, let me see something. Didn't it say something about relics? Let me see. Choose to activate. Oh no, you choose your relics when you when you zone in. Isn't that what it is? So maybe we can find out. Let's see here. Uh, character. Okay. So it says here, character oracle mirror for offensive, defensive, and relics will not take effect. Okay. So this means that for like the normal firepower mode, like your relics will be turned off. But from what I remember from seeing screenshots, you have a chance to like choose, make choices when you enter um the matchmaking mode to like choose like a like a like a template or something and i think you can like choose something so yeah 
Uh, you can't create a custom game? Uh, I don't think I can right now. I think it's only matchmaking. Fight! <laughs> yeah, exactly. Frederick gets it. Ty find the full map. Nah, attacker from the grass, you get it. I mean, it's better. It's it, that's gonna be the big. I mean, that's gonna be the point, right? You have to utilize. That's that should be like <laughs> the point. <laughs> True. I would still need nine players, so I would still need six more people. <laughs> right. We are we are the wild Pokemon now. So they have to, they had to find me and catch me. Catch me if you can. Everyone will touch grass, that's true. Finally. Finally. Finally, Rom solved the issue. It's about time. It's about time Des would thought of us. My goodness. Game devs, finally. <laughs> but yeah, the thing is, I mean, it is it is early morning in, in uh, CM side, so... It's not a big deal. <laughs> if anything, if uh, if it's done, then that's not a big deal. I'll try to find a, a more optimal time for me to match make. To, uh, to put some clips up and stuff. So, let's see. Yeah, if anyone has uh, CBT accounts or anything, uh, we do finally have three. So, if a couple more, I'm not sure. We'd still need six others, though. Sacrifice! Oh my god. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. <laughs> oh my gosh. I totally forgot about that mount. <laughs> I have Alexander. Yeah, I mean, if if, if other people wanna wanna queue in and see, oh, did you get the? Oh, is this the new one? Oh yeah, I didn't I didn't get to do the wheel yet. Like I said, oh, so, that is cute. Oh my god, what? This is the new mount. Oh my god, it's so cute. What the heck? Is that just an idle animation? It throws the little the little water bowl. Oh my god. I like the animation. I want to like see it again. <laughs> it looks so cute on the door. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Why is it so cute? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, door cute. <laughs> you have that mount. The mount's not even released yet. This comes out on Monday. It's the new, it's the new, it comes in the, the wheel. Oh my god. Why is this so cute? Why is this so cute? Unless you mean on CBT, then yeah. <laughs> oh my god. It's a really cute animation. Yeah, they did have the, the preview video. Actually, I saw because, um, let's see. Oh yeah, so this is a preview of the, sh of the wheel for, for, for uh, next week. So it has the Molten Colossus. Uh, we have the Seed of Yggdrasil. This has the discounts, like the 20% discount. Um, Dark Illusion card, Jack card, uh, Maple Fairy, and Firebird Cheery. Then we got, uh, what is this? Weak Puppet and Scarecrow over here and then the wheel we just have we have this thing that's what deathkin is writing on and it was super cute because i like i like how like when you look at this you can notice it's like a big water tank <laughs> in the back it's so funny it's so funny and then these are the cards that are here so it's scarecrow star Scarecrow, sorry, I don't know if I said that right. Uh, weak, weak Puppet Star, I believe that's. This one is Munex Star and Familiar Star as well. And then here we have these things. A little preview before I do like the other video. Golden Mora. Mora Mora. 
Uh, we got like the airship mat, packed, and Zanny. Love Zanny. I love. I love. Zanny. <laughs> so me and five more. Yeah, if you just if you just wanna if you just wanna queue if you just wanna match make um Alexander and see if you know because I had posted yesterday uh in the lobby my time oh my god oh my god so cute <laughs> so cute. They're like little, I don't know, like look like little like matchbox cars. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't. I can't. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> look at the size difference. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my god. This key. You know, too, because it's such a it's, it's such a bright mount, so it looks like it, that. I think that's why it looks like a toy car to me. You know, it has, it's it's such like a bright, like a saturated blue. It's so cute. <laughs> okay, I was gonna do I was gonna do a video, so I haven't. I so that I was gonna I was gonna do like a like a thing and probably post it on a Friday. Actually, that was the plan. I just didn't do it yet. <laughs> I was supposed to rec I think I was supposed to record it yesterday, then I was tired. <laughs> it's shooting water. I know, it's so cute! <laughs> it's so funny. Oh my god. Oh. Let's see. I was trying to get, um... Where is it? Because I was trying to get the older one, too. Right here. there yeah because this account doesn't have the older one I would I would like this one too you know well you know we'll get a couple of these Got time to go. oh I gotta do that too no I have I have a Tickets. Ba, 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 ba. YouTube, is it? What? Oh my God. Mm. YouTube is not receiving enough video. Nice. Yeah, I don't know. I'm still having the drops. Okay, now I think it's reconnecting. I'm still I'm still getting that issue, but I think it's my fault. I'm not sure if I opened the OBS up in Administrator today, so that could be my fault. Like, I'm noticing, I'm looking at my ping and I'm like, wow, my ping is like jumping by 200 too. And there's also, I also don't typically do like PvP tests also on CBT because my ping is usually at minimum 600. <laughs> and I don't think it's going to be that interesting to do. I, I have done GVG tests because at least like usually, oh, I'm going to get, I feel like I'm about to get DC. Um, usually, um... Like, GVG, usually it's not too busy. There isn't really a lot of people doing GVG on the CBT test. Um, so, uh, 
you know, but but PvP, there's there would be like at least at minimum, obviously like twelve people on the map and a lot of stuff happening. So, like at least for something like sixes or in twelves, it'd be a lot more, right? So, as far as that goes, on, G <laughs> on CBT, like there's when I've done all GVG testing, um, I think there's only been mainly like one or two other um, kills that actually are like full guilds on the CBT. It's crazy. That's why you need more monitors. Yeah, apparently. Exactly. <laughs> uh, well, then, let's see if I can get the other, the other mount. This one I think is really cute. I was just trying to get on my live account, but I don't think it's gonna happen. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> Whatcha? I have a lot of these tickets now. I already got I already got one of one of each of these things. <laughs> you have a party queue up? Queue up, we'll see see what happens. Start matchmaking. We'll see. We'll see we'll see if any if any matchmaking goes through. One or two. Oh wow. <laughs> Probably because it's getting it's getting more to the morning on the for everybody. How many fish can a free-to-play get with the event? I think people said 190. I think it was something like that. It says it, um... Yeah, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you open the tooltip, it should be here. So it's 110, 70. So this is like... Uh, 180. And then when you go to the shop, there's like the, the 10 you can get with Zenny. Over here. And then it's like 190. So. This amount is. A, yeah, it's cute, right? Oh my goodness. Look at everybody, so cute! Yeah, well, my, fa that, my favorite was definitely. The bunny bike was definitely like my I need this moment. Like, if, if I ever had an I need this moment in, um, in ROM, it was the bunny bike. And I think the second one was definitely the, uh, this moon mount. <laughs> I'm trying to get to work. Here we go. <laughs> okay. So now we have three, we have five. We're getting there. <laughs> that last picture that Lizzie posted, it almost looks like the, the official video they posted. You see the official preview video for the mounts and the, and the, uh, the Sankran outfits? They're so cute. <laughs> they had all the little preview things and was like riding around in the in the, in the little mounts <laughs> all around the town. It was so cute. <laughs> it was a really cute preview. Kemi, what's up? <laughs> hey Kemi, do you have a CBT account? <laughs> now I'm gonna just try to recruit everybody. Oh, we're trying. We're trying to queue for threes. <laughs> so now, so now, now we're at the point of like, hey, you got, a, you got, you got a CBT account. <laughs> I think we're at like five people. We're trying to even get nine people into the queue right now. I mean, we're ju we just want to see the map. We just want to see the map right now. It's not. It's not like serious PvP. <laughs> my key, my my ping is says nine 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 right now. <laughs> yeah, Alex, you should you should definitely invite invite Kemi. <laughs> and then and then we have six. <laughs> and then we have six. Let me let me uh let me post in the other Discord, uh, real quick actually. Let's 
Oh my god. That's that's funny, Justin. I don't I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Yeah, usually, usually my ping is like, usually at minimum 400 plus. It really depends on like the time of day and everything else too. A bunch of us are in Prentera, Kemi, right now. <laughs> but it's like, it's like Nessie, uh, Deathkin, a bunch of us are just hanging out here. <laughs> Should we have like a meetup spot? Should we just like stay here? <laughs> oh, should we go to like Southgate? Should we go to like Southgate on like... Is there different channels? I, th I don't even remember. I think there are like two channels in here. <laughs> yeah, I know. Has Mirabel well towns are always merged. Towns always have like their own merged um uh what what would it be called? I guess it's kinda like a mirror instance. The heck? <laughs> Saw them like slide. Oh good. Oh. Why are people flying up? Do you <laughs> what is happening? Oh, is is this like one of those rift things? Don't do weird stuff. <laughs> I don't want people bugging out. Like, wait, is that like, is that like the love rift thing? Anyway. Let's meet in South Gate for now. There. Yeah, if I have people in my friends, I have a bunch of people like in the guild itself. Can I even click you? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I, I think I clicked like the cat. You're all moving. All right, I give up. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. But yeah, towns uh, towns are merged, so like... That's why like the usually the chat channels are like that too. Oh my gosh. You know, it's not, it's not based on your... What is it called? Like channel at all. I was like sliding. Cammy! Deskin would do that, literally, at the exact same time. <laughs> I'm gonna go and hug Kemi. No, I'm a bubble. <laughs> I'm laughing. This is right here. This is right next next to us. <laughs> My God, I get. I was trying really hard not to yell. You could tell I get really triggered. <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it right now. <laughs> Is there one? I have no idea. I couldn't remember. I think there's two. What the heck? Is there two A? What is this? I have no idea what they have. I'm so confused looking at this screen. <laughs> Z Zabby doesn't even have CVT, Alex. And Alex hasn't been able to use his account in months. They don't they don't have CVT accounts. Nice try though. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> Think about the Chan though. I don't I don't I don't know if his is still active. Don't blame me, he doesn't read. Yeah, that's fair. My life. Oh my god, I need to get back in the chat. <laughs> about to be my fault. <laughs> You're getting distracted. Getting distracted because everyone's being cute. Why is Kimmy like invisible to me now? 
What happened? All I have is like the avatar thing. What's going on? Is that my settings? Oh my god. How do I say show everybody? I forgot what's foot. Yeah, it's that one. Okay. Muscle memory to the rescue. <laughs> it's muscle memory to the rescue. See, look at this. Kemi and I know what looks good. Okay, we didn't even like set this up. <laughs> That's so funny. That's so hecking funny. <laughs> we know what's up. We know what's up. Uh, did I feed this thing? No, I did not. I, sh I should probably finish this thing and get the, the wings, actually. I didn't even think about that. Oh yeah, the CBT server is done. I forgot. 800. I'll probably finish this with these hecking tickets. Let's see. Uh... Alright, let's, let's, let's try a little more, I guess, for this fount for now. DBT is a- oh no. <laughs> that's fair. I call- yeah, that's the one thing I- like, I, I will collect so much stuff on CBT and I'm like, great. I can take all my photos on CBT. <laughs> I could take all of my photos and video footage right here. <laughs> I, I I do a mix. It's it's really funny because I really do do like a mix of stuff. Um for videos. Sometimes sometimes like if I don't have a, a costume on my on my main account, I'll just go to CPT. <laughs> they'll they'll never know. They'll never know. <laughs> Can you enter uh, 3v3 if two parties are I have no idea. Oh, what did I get? Oh, okay, I got another ticket for a costume. All right, so we'll collect the male costume. And I will deposit that. In case I need for footage or anything else. Sometimes I'll even like collect like the male costumes and stuff too. I actually really like uh, some of the like stuff that they have sometimes to collect. Let's see what we got. Oh, okay, nice. There we go. There we, go. we got there. <laughs> All right, I didn't get the mount, but but I got to but I got but I got to jump on the chemic fashion trend, and that's just as important. And that's just as important, hundred percent. There we go. There we go. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> so many people do we have here? We have one of those beards. Seven? No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, just seven. <laughs> <laughs> Um, oh, sorry, you're talking to Lizzie. I'm like, I get, I get so confused when I see like the buff names. I'm like, is that for me? Does that say Nessie? <laughs> god damn it. Oh my god. <laughs> are they talking to me? Who are they talking to? <laughs> it's so funny. That's so, so funny. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I confused myself. Actually, it was funny. What was it? Someone someone actually messaged me. They got confused. They thought- I think they thought I was like in a morning stream. They thought I was up. Be 
because they saw the tag in um in someone's name or something and like uh and I think it was actually your name in, in the stream. And they're like, were you were you on like Kemi's stream? And I'm like, no, it's just in her name. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my god, Frederick, what the What the heck? What the heck? <laughs> I'm dying. Oh my god. <laughs> that is like the most accurate meme. Can we pin that? <laughs> <laughs> wait wait can you pin in one of these channels i have no idea i would pin that one like that one i would pin like specifically that meme because that one is really funny oh my god <laughs> that one's really good i don't have the option too so i'm not sure if you can pin in a like a stage chat channel i have no idea I don't know, Fred, um, Discord's always doing randoms. Damn! We tried. Maybe I'll bother an admin leader. I have to, you know, I have to, I have to test in, like, my, my, my test Discord server and see if it's even possible. Yeah, I'm gonna bother, oh my god, I gotta. Alright, I need, I need the infinite matchmaking queue option now. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna appeal to an admin. Can I have this meme pinned in my channel? It's very important to me. <laughs> I don't. I, yeah, I'm not sure if it's possible or not, but it'd be fun. <laughs> everyone's 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 getting dressed and getting fashion. I love it. <laughs> Your channel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just it's just a meme. It's 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 the it's the culmination of <laughs> of everything. Oh my god, that's too funny. <laughs> ay ay ay. Oh my god, yes, it actually looks so good on Dorum. Honestly. Honestly. Like, it looks good on, like, on, like, on, like, the human, but on Dorm, it looks really, really cute. Like, it looks really adorable. Because, like, they made it, they made it more of, like, 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 an opaque t-shirt and skirt and it's just like it just it just has more of like a cute vibe like for sure like i don't know it's just it's just way too cute this is way 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 too cute <laughs> oh my gosh i thought this was someone it's an npc i was i got confused for a second <laughs> i was like who's over there oh that guy. <laughs> oh my god. Oh yeah, the event. So if you want to know where to get the boxes, so the event, the event is like split into two things. So you have the cat backyard, which is where you feed the cat, the little fishies. Um, the boxes themselves is here, and then there's a couple of tabs. This tells you the event parts. The second tab is where um, it has an oracle challenge that gives you uh, the free-to-play fishies. The third tab is we have some discounts, 20% off some boxes. You can also get 10 of these fishies for Zenny. And then there's two boxes. There is the new box that has the new costume. This is the male one. This is the female one. 
Um, you always get five uh, of the dried fish per box. Uh, the costume is a 2% chance, and there's a 10% chance for the new headwear. Um, you basically get like a... No, no, no. You get you get the um, a random drop of the headwear. So you get any one of these. And then the second box is also, every time you open it, you get five uh, dried fish, a 0.2% chance for a um, thing that has the uh, contract voucher for last year's mount, a 2% chance for last year's costume, and a 10% chance for a ticket that allows you to choose from last year's headwear. So that's what these boxes are. And then the last tab is if you have extras from this box, you can turn them in for extra dried fishies. And then, like I said, to feed, um, you know, the, the, the fishies, you have to go back to the cat backyard section to do that. So. <laughs> What's up, Kikacha? How are you? How goes it? <laughs> oh my god. The meme is evolving. <laughs> the meme is evolving. <laughs> it's, it's too funny. Holy heck. How many we need? That's a good question. Um... I'm not I'm not sure if Lizzie's in queue. How many how many does Alexander have? Alexander, do you have three or do you have two? I can't remember. Oh crazy. What's up? Whoa. Crazy's pretty. <laughs> I love I love this outfit too a lot. Let's play! <laughs> Two people on Lizzie. Oh, okay. So yeah, if we only need like two more people, we just we just have to get some more people. <laughs> We're almost there. We're almost there. It only took two hours <laughs> to find nine people. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, gear is oh nice. All right, all right. We're finally we're finally getting there. We're finally getting there. We get a few matches and just look at the map. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> ay 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 <laughs> all kind of bull this is, this is this is the real the the real crossover server pvp <laughs> that's funny all right so make sure all right so let's uh check your cues i right, gotta requeue now that just i thought i just queued this just drop me I'm like trying to look at three chats right now. <laughs> yeah, the C plus global plus EU. It's the CPT server, exactly. <laughs> we were already. <laughs> Are pets even allowed in there? I don't know. I'll take I'll take out the the Osiris anyway. I'll see I'll see if they even zone in there. I guess it's a good question. <laughs> Chan's like, what is going on? <laughs> what am I being recruited for? It's a good thing to see, like, what what works, what doesn't. <laughs> Chan was out with the real Corgi army. <laughs> Okay, so we have three here. Oh, you can just run, obviously, with whatever. You mainly want to see the map. Uh, hopefully, hopefully, uh, you know, I would like to see it at least, uh, you know, three or three times. We'll see how fast the matches go and this and that. 
I have no idea what I'm doing, so. I'm, I'm a really good target. I'm so sorry for my team. <laughs> what chat? Where's this thing? Yeah. Balls. Flowers. <laughs> yeah, isn't it, isn't it time for... It's time for second pets for all the animals. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> yeah, I mean, just have fun with it. Just play whatever. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> the doggies went shopping. Oh, that's fun. That's fun. I always like um like when you could take the doggies out to the store. Like when you, like especially when you have a store that allows it, or obviously if you take them to the pet store that allows it, and you know they can kind of like sniff around and pick something off the shelf. That's always fun. <laughs> so it's when they like uh, like snuffle their nose in the middle of everything. <laughs> But it's just it's just really funny. Uh we're We're all in uh South Gate Beauty. Yeah, I mean that's fine too. Yeah, just queue. That's fine. I mean if if you want to solo queue, that's fine. It doesn't really matter. It works either way. Just queue up. Match meek. <laughs> Same works. <laughs> I mean, we don't know what works, right? We're gonna we're gonna see what works. We're gonna see some basics. Yeah, we can try it. I mean, it doesn't matter. We're just. I mean, we mainly want to see the map. We wanna you know, like we we don't know what's going on. That's the point. <laughs> Is um, you know mainly want to just see it uh, in action, and because I know um, I've only seen either clips or screenshots of the options you have when you um, zone in and all that. As far as uh, you get like some kind of options, I think for oh choosing stuff. <laughs> so I think we should have enough in queue. So I think we should have enough now. There's gear. I can't remember. I always have like everyone in the what's it called? Guild list. Just deal harder. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, is it happening? Oh my god. Wait, what just happened? What just happened? Oh my god, it's happening. Oh my god. 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 We're here. We did it. <laughs> what? What is this? I don't know what this screen is. <laughs> What's happening? Oh, is it the load in? <laughs> this is the load in. This, you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of um, the load in in Unite, Pokemon Unite. <laughs> Actually, a little bit. Everyone had to like load in before it started. Let's go! 
<laughs> I like this screen actually. I think this I think this screen's pretty cool. Hold on. Can I take a screenshot? Try to take screenshots while I can. <laughs> what is this? Oh, is this your Ymir? Oh, I think you have the option too. I guess you Ymir. I don't know what's happening. Oh my god, it's me! Oh, are these the party leads? <laughs> You're doing the idol animation. Yeah. Clicking around. I'm trying to see if I can do anything. Hold on. I'm trying, I'm trying to understand. This is a play test. Can I break anything? That's how you find out. <laughs> right, Kemi? Am I not? Am I crazy? The, the... <laughs> I was like, huh. I mean, most games do have you have like a load. Wait, why is there a timer again? Oh, is everyone loading? Is that why? A lot of games have these like loading screens now. gotta load a ymir build to ready up oh okay so it gives everyone a chance to load oh let's go we're here okay so this is the map here we go oh so this is what it looks like oh i'm sorry i'm gonna take here's the ui here's this and that i gotta i, gotta, I gotta do what i can i'm excited i'm sorry wait did it start <laughs> was there a countdown oh my god what's going on Oh, wow, this is actually, like, pretty tall grass, like, visually and everything. No! <laughs> well, I think I... Okay. Oh, so there's, like, pop-ups. I turned into a Kalitz first. <laughs> is that what happened? Is that what Kalitz... Uh... He does. <laughs> I was like, Wait, do we randomly spawn? I just realized that. I'm just gonna have like auto on. Oh gosh, someone's here. Oh my god, it's creepies. Don't hurt me. I died, I think. Because I've never PvP'd with, also with Kalitzberg before. Alex is me being mean to me. <laughs> Who's uh green greens? Oh, we're green. Oh my gosh. I have no idea what happened. Franz is cheating. <laughs> okay, so let me see. So so the end screen also has everyone in different colors. So there's green, red, yellow. It was so chaotic. I got kicked out. I wanted to run around. <laughs> we spawned our color. Yeah, so I rem I thought I thought uh I thought from a different screenshot, I thought the spawn camps were on the right hand side. Now I'm kind of intrigued. Green, yellow, red. I mean that's pretty typical of like, you know. Alright, next. <laughs> what the heck? Let's <laughs> see the minus <laughs> for a second. <laughs> I want to like run around the map for like a second. I want to like actually see the map. I was kind of like on auto, but I I want to I I should actually run around the map. <laughs> I should probably be. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's fine. If you're loading, that's fine. That's fine. I'm just excited. I got excited, okay? <laughs> just... <laughs> and only people can camp. It's not a random respawn. Yeah, so I mean, um Yeah, that's the thing is that we have to confirm is like the respawn points, um, how fast we respawn, things like that. Fenrir, yeah, I, I actually said before, I think Fenrir would be really good for this map. Um, actually. I think Fenrir would be good for this map. Dashing in and out. I, th yeah, that's, that's what, that's what I would think. Uh, uh, yeah, someone asked on YouTube, is, is 3v3 uh, going to be available on C server? Yes, it is, it has uh, been announced as new PvP content. 
Um, I'm. I don't think there's a time frame for release. It's currently in the testing phase on CBT. It's not in CN, so we don't have any time frame on. Um. When, you know, I think I think you. I I have a feeling once they start having like like a seasonal mode in testing, it'd probably be closer to, you know, to where they want it to be for release for releasing. Is your mirror switching working? I don't know, probably. I mean, as a PvP map, so I don't see why not. Technically? Mount? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we're gonna re in a second. Uh, friends has to, um... re -lock. But yeah, when I was thinking about it before, because I, op I opened up the job screen, and I was like looking, and I was like, "Huh." I was like, "I know, I know Fenrir's gameplay, like you know, game style." And I'm like, "I think he's actually probably like built for threes, actually. He seems like someone built for threes." Yeah, it is. <laughs> it was pretty short. <laughs> it was definitely pretty short. So that's the thing too, like is it going to be too short, You're like, you know, does it need like an extra objective of some, you know, it is going to be a max of five minutes, but you know, is it going to be too short if all the matches are like under two minutes, you know, is that not satisfying enough of a versus map, you know, that's going to be a good question. And all that. Fixing my costume, I feel like, I mean. <laughs> I went for the kill. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> that's the thing, too, you know, it's because, you know, I know we've been talking about like the strategy part, but will people do it? I don't know. Fire. Yeah, you hear that? Is the mic picking it up? <laughs> that's a good question. I have fireworks in the area. I don't I don't know. I guess people are excited. It's a Wednesday. <laughs> I guess people are excited it's a Wednesday night. Rock on, friends. Oh, that's right. I think I think it is it is a holiday. Oh, that's right, yeah, happy holidays. Dog was going aggro here. Oh, oh. Or <laughs> Well, I mean true, he could be countered, but I think I think Fenrir, like like just looking at his Listen, I'm just saying, looking at him, I see it. I don't think about the counters. I'm not a PvP person. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think in PvP. I don't think in PvP. <laughs> yeah, I kind of want to see see it again. I want to see. I want to see if we always spawn in the same spot. It's my big question right now, primarily. Now I'm curious. Now I am curious. Are there unlockable stuff for 3v3? Um, so we don't have any information because it's currently in like just a testing mode right now. It's in a casual testing mode. Um, so we don't know what type of rewards to expect for like a seasonal or cup mode right now. So. No, well, what, what I mean is, okay, so you remember how the map had four spawn points? I'm curious if those are um, static or not. Like, like is the blue, uh, sorry, not blue, is the, is the green, um, red, yellow always in the same spots? Or does it actually change, is my question, when the map starts? I just wasn't sure about that, because I haven't, I haven't seen, like, a lot of stuff. Boost speed, food. Do I even have any? This, right? No. No, it's like the steak. Oh. This thing. Should be this thing. Right? Yeah, because that's Castaway. I get confused. Okay. <laughs> I get confused. 
very easily. <laughs> what? No, wrong one. I didn't even notice that the were the pets zoned in. <laughs> it was so chaotic. All right, let me let me re let me redo the queue. Let's redo it real quick. Let's see. Whatcha? <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I keep running around. <laughs> I got hyper. <laughs> All right. So, uh, so yeah. So if you're ready, uh, again, let's let's see if we can at least see uh one more. Ba, 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 ba. Ba, 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 ba. At least get a couple more, maybe. Yay! <laughs> Alexander's like, let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready to beat up Nessie again. <laughs> I saw. I saw what he did. He went straight for me every single time. Although that was interesting because I I've never I didn't st I I never stepped at the PVP as Kalsberg so it was interesting like turning into one I'm like I don't know what's going on. All right, so Gira and Lizzie queuing. Let's remind everybody to queue up again. <laughs> They're at my party. Tall, yeah, here's <laughs> the tall thing. Did you change your hair, hair color to pink? I mean, I'm not biased or anything, but you totally should. 100%. <laughs> you could. There's even some some cute headwear with the pink hair now. It was funny too, because then when when it was like acting like the the key was going in, it it kind of stalled out forever, huh? <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh, did we break it? That's what testing's for, huh? Oh, for a second I thought it was going. <laughs> Please Q, I beg. Let's see. We have did anyone log off? Let me see. One, two. We missing. That one do you see? Let's see. Aww. Kimmy's enjoying the photo shoot. <laughs> That's all that matters. <laughs> Heck yeah. Uh, let's see. Oh, there we go. I was about to check in with somebody. I'm like, oh my god. There we go. Oh my god, it's happening again. It's happening again. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, so it seems like they... I mean, the one thing that's interesting is like... I guess the ample amount of time everyone has to load. <laughs> Is this? this looks badass with the Fenrir hair and the and the eye patch? Let's 
So, let me see. So I see this check mark here. Is it like a ready up? Do you just click? Do you like click something? I'm afraid. <laughs> choose your mirror. I'm not using a Ymir. Why would I choose something? I like how I have to. Oh, it's funny. I did this for a video. I changed. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's an order of some sort. I think I think it's still just weights. Like, you know what I mean? I think you had the option, like last chance, I guess, to swap. Is what is I mean, that was the impression I got. Like, what does it say on the top? Like, you know? I don't know. Let me take a screenshot. Right. So I think I think it is the same. So I think it is the same. Everyone has like the colored dots and all that. Let's see something. Yeah, because you can go around this way. Right, let's run it. Let's run around for a second. Because this looks like a fourth camp. So you see, oh, you can actually walk here. Is an NPC here? Do you do something? Are you like a buff or something? Everyone see that aura? I don't know what that does. So soon as so as soon as interesting. Trying to see. So you can see on the mini map. Um take screenshots. So passing through. Okay. So Interesting. So this little spot seems to not act as grass there. Apparently red team is at eight. Holy heck. I'm gonna try to get into the center here. So we could see um all these little like boxes and all that. You could see like <laughs> they got me in the end. Um you can see a lot going on. Like a lot of extra... What's the word? Oh my gosh. Decorations and stuff to kind of like move around and maneuver. I'm like trying to find words as I'm trying to like think. <laughs> trying to like think as I'm in here. I just keep clicking confirm until they confirm it. Yeah, maybe you don't have to click it. I don't know. Maybe it's just a timer. I, I know I saw a different type of screen or something. Maybe it was for something else. <laughs> I turned into this who did that. That was uh, probably something from the from the Kalitzberg. Uh, yeah, Kalitzberg. I'm like, am I even saying the word right? I don't know what's happening anymore. Oh my god. That's so funny. Yeah, I was just running around the whole time, so... <laughs> Thank you for not targeting me. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. Yeah, I kind of hope um I kind of hope we can coordinate like a like a bigger test of, of everyone being able to see it because I would I would like to it does it does feel very fast like I feel like you crash it I feel like I went first that's fine um because I feel like uh it does feel very fast I feel like as soon as like I'm I'm looking at the map I'm like oh it's over so <laughs> um I think maybe leave it uh at two for now uh maybe we could try to court maybe i'll try to coordinate um another time we could try to do something um you know this this time frame later in the night seemed to work out a bit better so maybe we can do it uh i'll schedule it like a like more at the <laughs> <want> to kill <laughs> <laughs> just 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 1v1 him bro just just, just duel him <laughs> look so so yeah so like we said at the beginning of the screen look 
Let me let me teach you something, Alex. So now you can do a custom room using the twelves map. You can do a one v one room or like a one hundred versus one hundred room, <laughs> and all that sort of thing. You can do custom room now. Yeah, we can take a picture. Let's hang out. Let's do let's do just some fun stuff. <laughs> Now it's time to vibe. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's put, let me... Uh, so it should be this one. Because <laughs> I, I, I'm real little tired. I, I, I gotta go eat dinner. So <laughs> let me see. Garrus says, let's try and see 100-100. Oh, do you want to see that one? Maybe, maybe we can get that room open. I think it's just a custom room. Yeah, maybe we, maybe we can open that one up real quick. Let me see. Um, in that in that case, if you want to, um, um, like we can merge the parties. <laughs> we can uh we can merge the parties or whatever, and do like a like a six v six or something. In the in the twelves room, just to like see it or whatever. Do something like that with one i mean it's it's not a hundred and, and and one party but but if you want to like open up the map it would just be like i don't think it's a match make it's a custom room is what it's supposed to be like it's a room um like let's see like we'll just do that i don't know what that says i have no idea what this is this is the room name I don't know. I don't even know what I, or or is it just a hundred? I thought it was a custom room thing. Whoops. Can someone else like just apply to that room or something? I don't think it's a matchmaking, is it? Oh, it's funny. I was looking at this and I'm like, oh, it's server four. <laughs> is that what's supposed to be? What does it say? One. Do people just like apply into it? I don't even know. I have no idea. Dude, how do I go back to this thing? Okay, so gear is on the other side. I think this is the ready check. So if you wanted to try this one real quick. Um let's see. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Alex. Yeah, okay, so Alex joined my side. I have no idea what he did, <laughs> but it, it almost looks like the um, like a different version of the, you know, like the other like custom room screen, you know, because it should it should just be up to 100, 100. Let me see. I'm just gonna click it. Let's see. Is it doing anything? No. <laughs> I don't know what I clicked. What does the index say? <laughs> starting. Oh, okay. It is starting then. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you can just start it. Yeah. That's what I thought. It's just a custom room. It's just a custom room in the, in the 12 map. So it still has a countdown. It's just, um, oh, does it still have like the objectives? I thought it was just like a, I thought it was just the, like a, like a room room of the corridor. Like they said, I don't even know how to feel about that. What? I'm confused. I'm so confused. I'm actually confused. Here we go. How's it doing? Um, I just I just wanted to see it, so I I did just click start. Gear was I think inviting people, but I didn't know it would be like the 12th map. There's even the cart. What the heck? 
I don't even know how to feel about this one. So, so it's a 12s map? Because I thought, I thought, I thought it'd be like a, like a, like a different kind of like scrim map. Large map? It's just the 12s map. Not new. So it's just, it just looks like actually even the, the 12s, um, what'd you call it? Like objectives. Which actually surprised me. Huh. Yeah, so then I, I guess they did it this way. So... I guess that's a thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. This 12's rendering thing always gets me. Holy heck. <laughs> it's too funny. Yeah, so it's just it's just twelve. It's literally it's literally just the twelve map. I'm actually kinda surprised. I thought I thought it would just kinda be like I don't know, maybe I didn't know what to expect. I had a uh... I had auto on and I did not. <laughs> I was like, why is that character not doing anything? That's funny. All right, well that that kind of told me what I guess I needed to know about this. So I guess I can get feedback on on this one. I'm just kind of confused. Like what? I don't know. I'll, 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 I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna think on this one. I'm gonna think on this one. But, uh, I do, I do have to... I can't leave? What about this? <laughs> oh, I guess because it's not, like, a, like a thing? Am I not allowed to leave? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay. It's just being weird. What is it doing? I broke it. <laughs> Oh wait, did I leave the party, but I didn't leave the map? I don't know what it's saying. Leave the party. You didn't leave the party. I don't know. I'm trapped, dude. I'm trapped. Why did, why did you leave? Why did you leave the party? You abandoned me? That's crazy. Unbelievable. How did Alex do this to me? How dare he? <laughs> I was being bullied. I feel that. <laughs> I understand. I understand. All right. So that so that showed us what that. So I mean. I... All right. Well, I'll 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 post my feedback on that also. But uh, but the the three snap definitely looks interesting. I would I would like to like. Like, I would like to look at the map, um, outside of, like, a scrim to really, you know, be able to, you know, deep dive into it if possible. I think that would be ideal. <laughs> what a meanie. Just like Zenubia one-shotting me in, in, in 15 airship. Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we got to see, um, you know, some stuff on CBT. Something I also showed, and, and I do want to, like... Piercing Hour cannot hit Tower in 12s. Oh, no. <laughs> just go inside and explore and not fight. Yeah, you know, that would be, it would be nice to, like, just, just be able to, like, see... It, or, or have, like, even if it's just, like, an overview, like, of the map. Just to look at the... The... The thing. I forgot I was gonna open. Oh, this thing. Okay. 
<laughs> something that I remember I showed last time and I thought was pretty cool. I'd like to actually look at it again because maybe I can compare it to the different stream I did. Is that they, they updated the gear suggestions where it actually pulls information from other players. And I thought that was actually really cool. Um, I should probably pull from like a character that people are a little more familiar from. So that way it makes a little more sense. People, okay, so we have Jorm, right? So we have Jorm. So, uh, so basically, instead of like the preset suggestions that they had the assistant, you know, have there, they basically now pull data from the server from actual players, and it resets every Monday, and uh, they give the suggestions based off that, and it actually gives you like the data set of like percentages of this many player, like 3% players uh, was wearing the wizardry stuff. Um, but 73% players is wearing his book. Um, I don't know what happened here. It's CBT though. So, <laughs> um, and then you have the ignore defense, you know, the, the ancients that they were wearing, um, and also the cards. I think what's really nice about this part of the update is actually the card suggestions. Um, and how, you know, how often that, uh, they're being used. I thought this was really cool. Like, Zenubia and stuff. So, actually, uh, like, someone was asking me about Elf. So, this is actually, like, a pretty good example. So, like, let's look at Elf. We can look at the accessory slot, and we see 25% of players here on the CBT server was wearing, um, Witch of Calamity card. And then, you know, 14% and 13% were wearing the Moonlight Tenderline cards, which is, you know, basically the next, the next best, right? You know, and then we have Edgar all over, because Edgar's all over the place. <laughs> Edgar's good. And, uh, let's see here. Can you take pictures? Let me see. Where are you? Where do you, just tell me where to be. <laughs> other stuff and um you know for something like Kaltzberg it shows like obviously her synth weapon um actually it's funny because actually last time there was a percentage on holy vendor and now it actually says zero so I guess it can be updated to sort of be like this um it could actually even be updated to go back down to zero but it looks like it won't remove it it won't it won't remove and have nothing in the slot so that's actually kind of interesting and you can see like the variables and everything. And what's also nice is it does show shadow equipment suggestions now, which is actually really, really nice. And all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're 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 done. We're done. I'm just kind of like, I'm gonna talk about stuff and wrap things up, and we're gonna take some fun pictures. You wanna you want us to go by you, Kemi? All right, let me go over here. Uh, we're gonna look cute over here. <laughs> This is my window. It's very serious. All right, let's see. Here we go. <laughs> I was like, wait, we doing the photo shoot? I'm coming back. <laughs> but you can also see like the Molten Colossus card. Um Poitata star. And I thought I thought I think what's really nice about this this part of the update is the um the shadow equipment suggestions now is updated into the into this to help everybody. And I still don't know what this bottom part is suggesting though. I still haven't figured that part out. <laughs> then the mo the most important part is the is the everybody looking awesome part. <laughs> <laughs> that's no problem thank you so much for for for, for being here you know <laughs> alex already knows his pose <laughs> it's this one yeah 
little scary when I'm too used to which parts are the part of the photo options. <laughs> <laughs> because I want to like go back and like change it and I'm like here we go this is also a good good angle there we go the CBT made you repatch that's weird <laughs> they're like oh my gosh what are what are, what are these stillies doing we need to patch them out <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Alec was already like, I know my pose, I know my outfit, I am set, I am ready. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Oh, the one thing I love about also this outfit is like this cute little like... Um... Little anklets. <laughs> These little, like, cute little anklets on the bottom. I think they're super duper cute. <laughs> absolutely adorable. Absolutely adorable. <laughs> I hang out on, in all our styles. All our styles. Quite the styles. <laughs> I like this angle too. It's a good one. <laughs> no, the line's too long. Come in front. You're a dorm. You're short enough. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> so cute. I actually, I actually like the little visor you chose. It's actually really good. That's it's so good. <laughs> Alex, best photo poser, and then Deathkin, the cutest cat. There we go. We'll have our titles. <laughs> I have to grab these screenshots right after. Oh my gosh, and now ever a choice for the photo session. Ron CPT though, so please remember that. <laughs> we're, we're not on a live server, so please join the correct server. <laughs> yeah, 3v3 sleep. Rob photo shoot real stuff. Yeah, okay. oh my god, you guys. <laughs> Holy heck. That's actually pretty funny. I don't blame you though. It's fine. You're right. Photo shoots are the real deal though. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna in the Alright, if more people are logging in, I'll, I'll just grab the current uh screenshot I have to share into the Discord. <laughs> That's actually really funny. <laughs> The real, the real end game. Costume deposit? No. Costume photo shoot? Yes. <laughs> ay ay ay. <laughs> Jesus. Too funny. Too funny. I'll probably, uh, let's see, what time is it? Probably be around for another, like, 10, 10, 10, 15 minutes max or so. So, so if you are joining the CBT for a photo shoot, please do so promptly. <laughs> yeah, no, thank you for, for hopping in. Uh, maybe I'll make a, a bigger notice of it next time if I were to do something like this again. For sure. For sure. <laughs> 
you know, I tried I tried to give a shout out on the on the CBT area, but I'm not sure if enough people saw it. So that's okay. That's okay. It's okay. It's okay. If you're on the way, I don't mind waiting, but you know. <laughs> it's okay. But I'm not I'm not like <laughs> Mr. Pose and stuff. We're having a good time. It's fine. Oh, is that what happened? Is someone hiding? I was like, I thought someone left and I was like, where's everybody? Oh, there they are. Hello. <laughs> I was so funny because it looks like two people, but <laughs> but it's Devine. <laughs> oh my god. I get my own oh my god, I get my own Kotex photos. That's amazing. <laughs> It's so funny, with, you know, because everyone has some 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 folks have like their own looks, and it's fun when you see um like even like the Discord photo contest, because like because I'm always like I I like browsing them, and then I'm like I'm like oh it's this person oh it's that person, <laughs> like some people just have like their signature looks, you know, and it's fun. It's fun. <laughs> Trying to like angle it because I'm not centered, so I have to try to like angle it to fit everybody. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> my Alex goes, my signature look is looking awesome. I feel that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What's up, Rambunctious on YouTube side? How are you? <laughs> we're doing a we're doing a photo shoot. <laughs> we're doing the real end game stuff now. <laughs> <laughs> Yank it, yeah. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Oh my gosh. Too funny. Too funny. But yeah, you know, today we got we did get to see a little bit of threes. Um I have to see if I can get like some because I know like I have like the stream overlay, so so probably some stuff of the UI was a little covered. Um so you know I will try to see if we can get if I can get like some clips of it, um where you can see everything. Um and, you know, because I did get some screenshots and all that. Actually, I'll, I'll throw them into the chat, actually. I forgot. I'm really, I'm not, I'm not the, uh, the smartest, um, crayon in the toolbox here. So, here we go. Uh, <laughs> you know, as far as, like, uh, let's see. You know, showing the map and everything. I'm going to throw that into the chat on Discord side so you can kind of see. Check something. Yellow, red, green. Yellow, red. Okay, so I think the spawn points are the same because that was like my first, my first. Whoa, because <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Everyone started going. <laughs> oh my gosh! Now I got like. All right, hold on. Let me let me reopen the camera. We gotta we gotta. Whew. There we go. Okay. Oof. Okay. <laughs> sometimes sometimes we got sometimes we gotta. Sometimes we gotta reset the tripod a little bit, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys are so cute. You guys, <laughs> you guys are like rearranging yourselves even without me rearranging the camera yet. <laughs> oh. You only see a few? Um, so Lizzie, if you if you um do this in camera mode, you should be able to see everybody, actually in in the top actually i don't know if you can see because of my ui on the top right um there's two toggles one that looks like a bunch of people if you toggle it it should automatically turn on the see everybody or the max setting without having to go into your player settings for it and all that this should be nidhogg's default look by the way default body look that's my personal opinion <laughs> Man, YouTube's gonna bonk me if you stay there like that. My god. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> the waterfall Nidhogg hair. Definitely one of my favorite styles. <laughs> it's 
too, too funny. Yeah, I wasn't sure if you could see it because I have like obviously like the stream overlay stuff, so I don't know. I wasn't sure if you could see it, but um, but yeah, there's a multiplayer setting and then like the the max setting thing. But uh, but yeah, you have the option right in in the camera settings at least, for sure. But there is the option in the player settings. I actually had to find it earlier. I had to go. I I was like looking it. I'm like. I'm working off mu muscle memory, but somehow we're making it work. <laughs> it's too funny. <laughs> These new wings are really, really cute, though. They're shiny. So shiny. So reflective. I like how the the flower. You know, I didn't get to see a chance to see like the back. I like the the flowers in the back showing in the back. It's really pretty. <laughs> and then let's give. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna turn on the. Let me see. No, I did the wrong one. There it is. <laughs> turn on the UI so everyone gets gets the. You know, shout out to everybody that 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 showed up today. Thank you so much. For helping out with the the queue and everything, especially, <laughs> and showing up for the photo shoot because that's important too. <laughs> it's all good. We're just having fun. <laughs> it's okay. You can block me. It's all good. There's plenty. There's that. I'm already. I'm already on on the screen. It's fine. Yeah, CPT gang. Exactly. <laughs> Hopefully we can have a like a like a nice like bigger test or something. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much, everybody. Hopefully, hopefully we got to you know kind of review some stuff, think about some stuff, think about what's possible, you know, like think about some ideas of of you know what what um you know start 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 strategizing right <laughs> start strategizing start thinking about um some options. Uh, for the for the new map, the new game mode, you know, um, like I said, it's it's only in a, in a in a very casual testing phase, so we'll see what happens with that in particular. Um, I was trying to see like what the um, the options screen and how to pop that up, unless it's not a threes thing. I don't know. I gotta do a little more research then on that on that one because I thought that was like an optional thing. I gotta see if someone else can advise me on how to bring up that screen. <laughs> With effects off the swords invisible. What the heck just happened? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Yo, MV MVP, let's go! <laughs> who got it? Who got? It? Let's see. Let's see who got the MVP. <laughs> oh, <me. laughs> the chaos. The chaos at the top of the hour. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> oh my god, everyone went full alert. <laughs> the power of auto, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's see who pulled the angeling. Oh wait, it's my fault. Apparently, <laughs> I was. I was like, "What's going on?" <laughs> all right, that's that, all right. That, that's a. I think we've definitely peaked with that MVP happening. I think. <laughs> all right, that was really funny. That was really funny. This was uh This was a blast. <laughs> Thank you so much, everybody, on Discord side and on YouTube side. If you want to review anything that happened today, I do have the VOD over on YouTube. If you want to check out the footage, 
hopefully the footage is fine. I'm, I am having some tech issues still with OBS and YouTube, so hopefully that's fine. If not, I'll get some clips at a different time. I'll figure it out. <laughs> but thank you so very, very much for everyone checking out the stream today. I really, really appreciate you all and everything. We had a lot of fun. Thank you, everybody, for helping out with the queue so very, very much on CBT. I really do appreciate it. <laughs>